Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's Rich Man from Rich Man Knows Tech. Today, I wanna to go over cleaning your fire stick. Now, I don't mean getting a scrub brush and soap and water and scrubbing that thing. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about cleaning your memory. Now, if you're anything like me and you're downloading a bunch of apps onto your fire stick, once in a while, you may get a pop-up saying that your fire stick is low on memory. You need to clean some of that up today. I'm going to show you how. Now hopefully guys, today is the day I've earned your subscription. If you like this kind of content, please consider going down, hitting that subscribe button below. And even more important, smash that like button for me. It really helps me out with the YouTube algorithm. It lets them know that you like this kind of content. Also, if you don't have a VPN yet, make sure you check out those two links in the description below. IPVanish and ExpressVPN both have great discount links, and if you click on them, you're gonna save yourself some money on a VPN, and you'll be helping out the Rich Man channel, and I really do appreciate it. Now, let's get on with the video. So now you'll see, I'm here on my Fire Stick home screen. Actually, this is my Fire TV, but it'll, it'll be the same for you on your Fire Stick or your Fire Stick Lite. So what you wanna do first is go over to your settings. Now I know some of you might have a new layout on your Fire Stick. They are shipping out a new layout these days and it's, it's gonna to come to your Fire Stick soon. And I'll go over that with you in a future video. In the meantime, this is the old layout we're gonna go with. But if it's the new layout, just make sure you go to your settings. So that's what we're gonna do now. We're gonna head over to settings Once you get there, look for applications. Click on applications. Now here, scroll all the way down to the bottom where it says manage installed apps or manage installed applications. And you'll see over here, this is the space I have left on my Fire Stick, on my Fire TV actually. So you'll see I've got 619 megabytes of 5.59 gigabytes still available. And there's very little space there and I've been getting that dreaded you know memory is getting low fire stick getting full of memory pop-up so we need to clear some of that out the first thing that you want to do before you do anything else while you're in here we're just going to clear out the cache of some of these apps we've been using so click on manage installed applications and here you see all the apps that are on my fire tv and if you hover over one of them and you look over here, you'll see what the cache is. The cache on this one is only 12 kilobytes, so you don't have to worry about that. We're looking for stuff with a little bit more of a memory than that. Keep scrolling down. Here's Alexa Shopping, that's also 12 kilobytes. Amazon Free Time, music. I'm gonna keep scrolling down here. Okay, so now you see on the, on the Amazon App Store, we've got 5.12 megabytes. So we're gonna click on the App Store, and go down and just clear the cache. Okay, now we're gonna go back one click and we're gonna keep going down and looking for something that's over 12 kilobytes. Cinema HD, that's a little bit over. I'm not too worried about it if it's in kilobytes. I'm looking for stuff that's in megabytes. Okay, so we've got Plex here. That's 3.59 megabytes. I'm gonna click on that. Go down and clear the cache out. Go back, Pluto TV, that's 1.3 megabytes. And we're gonna go down, we're gonna clear that cache. And weather, 1.71 megabytes. We're gonna clear that out too. That's not gonna affect the performance of anything on your Fire Stick. If anything, what this is gonna do is help to speed up your Fire Stick or your Fire TV. So now when we go back to manage installed apps, you see we're already at 655 megabytes of 5.59. So that cleared out a little bit, but not a whole heck of a lot. So the next thing we're gonna do is look for an application that you may not be using anymore. There's probably some apps that you've downloaded along the way and you don't use them anymore or you tried them out and you forgot to uninstall them and they could be taking up space. So we're gonna go back in here to manage installed apps. And we're going to look for an app. Let's start at the top. So 
So we're going to look for an app that you may not be using anymore. So I tried out Anthem TV a while ago. I'm not using it anymore. It's 73.34 megabytes. So we're going to click on that and we're just going to go down to uninstall. Are you sure? And then just click uninstall. And let's see, let's go down. Uh, look for something else I want to uninstall here. I'm going to install Peacock TV. I can always reinstall this stuff, so it's no big deal. But I haven't been using Peacock TV, so click on that. Go down to uninstall. Are you sure? Yes. Okay, now let's go back to manage installed apps by going back one click. And you'll see that we now have 801 megabytes of 5.59 gig available. So that's getting a lot better. I'd like to get it up to at least a gigabyte of storage that's available. So the last way we're going to talk about is to uninstall some of those APKs that you may have downloaded when you're installing some third-party apps on or videos or music or even pictures onto your Fire Stick or Fire TV. So this is how we're going to do it. We're going to look for a program. If you go up to the search icon and you're going to start typing in ES and we're looking for ES File Explorer. So I just typed in ES and it's already popping up. So let's scroll down, click on that, and this is the one you want. It's called ES File Explorer File Manager. Now there's a couple of different versions of this. There's a free version and there's a paid version. There's the pro version. What you're going to do here is, you know, I'm going to download it since it's in the cloud. I've or I already own it. It's going to be free for you guys. It'll say get it. It's free. So I'm going to download it back onto my Fire TV. And you're going to come up to this screen where it asks you to sign up for a free trial or restore your version. You don't have to do anything here. What you want to do is go up to where you see this X button up here. Just scroll up and, and scroll over to it's highlighted and then click on it. It's going to shut down that pop-up and now you're into the free version of ES File Explorer Manager. Now, what you're going to want to do here is, is you want to find those APKs. The first thing you want to do is scroll down to some of these top ones here. If you have like extra music on here, if you click on music, you're going to see your, your music files if you've downloaded any. I, I haven't, so there's nothing on here for me. The same thing for movies. Click on that and I have an empty folder. So I'm going to be looking for those APK files. They're going to be right here in this folder. So I'm going to go down here. I'm going to scroll over to app. I'm going to open that up and then we open up the folder and these are all my various applications. But we're just looking for the APKs. So you're going to scroll down to where it says user apps. Click on user apps. And then all the way down the bottom, you see where it says all APKs. And we're going to scroll down to that. Once you click on it, these are the APKs or the install files that are still left on my Fire TV. I'm going to uninstall all of these. And the way you do it is you're going to put these into the trash. So you're going to, have, you're going to scroll over, hold down on the enter button for three seconds, and you'll see it, there's now a check mark. And there's white circles on all these. So if you just scroll over to each one of them and click once, it's going to select each one of them. Okay, now that they're all selected, we're going to delete them. So you want to scroll over to the left and then down and then over to where it says delete. Once that's highlighted, click on that. Are you sure you want to delete five items? I'm going to select OK. And what this does is it moves them into your, your, your recycle bin. So they're not yet totally deleted. So when you have to get them totally deleted to restore that memory to your Fire Stick. So now we're gonna go over to where it says recycle bin, click on that, and you see they're all still here. So now you're gonna scroll down and scroll over to where it says clear all. You click on that. Are you sure you want to empty recycle bin? 
So you see file cannot be restored after deleted. So we're going to clear all. And now they're gone. So we're going to go back to the home screen. Okay, so now we're going to go back to settings, which you can scroll over to settings, or you can select the shortcut, which is the home button. Press and hold the home button down for three seconds. It's going to bring up this menu where you can take the shortcut right to settings. Click on that. And we're going back over to applications. Then down to manage install applications. Now you're going to see here, I have recovered a lot of storage space. I, I now have 1.3 gigabytes of space out of 5.59 gigabytes. And I've still got a ton of apps left on the fire stick. And I've got, now I've got room left over where I can download and try out some new stuff. So that's it for today, guys. This is Rich Man. I'll see you next time.